calligraphy, the art of beautiful writing, has traveled far and wide since its origin. The first international calligraphy festival of Kerala was organized by the Kacha Tathapa Foundation in Kochi. Calligraphy derives its name from the Greek words kalos meaning beauty and graphy meaning to write. Brush, pens, pencils, dip pens, swat tip pens and colored inks are used to create this beautiful art. Calligraphers from around the world took part in the four-day festival. Narayana Bhattadil, the first designated Malayalam calligrapher and his family curated the festival. Bhattathiri was initially apprehensive about organizing the event but was pleasantly surprised by the response. I am a Malayalam calligrapher. I am a Malayalam calligrapher. I am a 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 calligrapher. I am ഞാൻ <laughs> അതിനേക്കാൾ <laughs> will provide a platform for calligraphers to showcase their skills and exchange ideas. There were exhibitions, workshops and panel discussions which helped the participants learn about calligraphy techniques, materials and art. Michel D. Anastasio, arguably the best and authentic Hebrew calligrapher, mesmerized attendees with his inimitable craft. I am creating my, my unique style because uh, I, I don't like to copy the other calligraphy. I'm creating for my sentiment and my emotion for the Hebrew letters because um, normally for the calligraphy Hebraic, it's just letters in the, in the square. I want to move letters in the square. For, for, for me, it's very important to, to creating, creating, creating the, the new style of the art. Of the art. In 2015, India introduced its own rupee symbol through a competition held by the Union Government. The design by D. Udaya Kumar, HOD of Design IIT Guwahati, was selected. I spent about two to two and a half months. Uh, as soon as the competition was announced, I started to work on it. It's not that I worked continuously throughout the day. So I was on and off uh, on to the designing of the symbol. Yeah. So it was not like a continuously I was there. Yeah. So yeah, that's, that's how, that's the duration I, I took. Uh, the symbol uh, should reflect uh, the Indian culture and tradition. So that was one of my primary goals. How do I kind of bring out the Indian culture and tradition? India being a very diverse country, it is always a very difficult and a challenging task to kind of come up with a symbol that kind of reflects the entire country. So then I felt the script was one of the best uh, visual signs that can represent the country to a larger extent. So I used the Devanagari script and also I, I integrated the uh, Roman script. Yeah. So where you can see uh, R and R, it's kind of expands to rupee and rupees, which is which denotes the uh, Indian currency sign. Yeah, so. A typographer, designer, and teacher by profession, 
Uday Kumar was one of the 19 delegates at the ICFK. My research is on Indian typography and specifically looking at Tamil typography. And we often look at letters, poems, scripts and study them and understand them, their evolution, the tools used. And calligraphy also deals with letter forms. And so uh, I uh, naturally had an inclination towards calligraphy. And though I'm not a calligrapher as such, but I'm very much uh, interested in calligraphy and I deeply appreciate the calligraphy and the calligraphers and their works. Yeah, so. I think such events should happen in every state, I should say, because India is a diverse country and every state has its own script. And uh, not many people are aware of their own script and also calligraphy as an art form. And I think in events like this uh, will really encourage the youngsters to first be aware of it and also take it as a profession, or if not as a profession, at least as an interest and develop their own uh, aesthetic sense and also about understanding the letter, uh, understanding of their own scripts. There are several types of calligraphy like Gothic, Western, Arabic, Copperplate, Roman, Hebrew, among others. Some were showcased at the exhibition. The delegates were only happy to explain their styles to the visitors. This is very good. Um, gallery is very well, workshop is good, um, everything, everything very well. Filmmakers, art enthusiasts and students throng the venue. The four-day calligraphy festival concluded on October 5th with the promise to return again next year.